I really just went and got a bagel sandwich. I had to do it to him, Tompkins Square Bagels. It was just one of those mornings and Natalie's OJ. I mean, what gets better than this? <laughs> Good morning, happy Vlogmas day seven. I am cozied up by the fire. <laughs> Again, just so thankful to have a couch. I didn't have a couch for two months and I just really embrace this couch now. I'm so happy. I'm sitting on my computer right now. I just got Vlogmas day six up and I am trying to Christmas shop right now and it's so hard. My family is the only person I know what to get for is my mom because she'll like hint at things or like I just know her taste um, and I just like I've had some ideas for a while my brother just snapchatted me and he was like because I asked him I was like what do you want for Christmas because the only way I can get him to respond is if I snapchat him does anyone else have that with their siblings younger siblings like I can only get him to reply if I snapchat him or if I call him texting it's just he doesn't know it and he was like I'm really getting into photography I'm like Literally since when? I have to beg you to take a photo of me for my Instagram, so, um, <laughs> but we shall see. And my dad really, really don't know. Maybe he's texting me right now. Let me, let me just ask him. Let's just see what he says. Ho, ho, ho. What do you want for Christmas this year? Question mark. Um, and then Ryan, guys, I literally don't know. I really don't know. And I'm leaving next week. And so I need to get Ryan's gift ASAP. Ryan's gonna be here for a while because he's like not going, well actually he's not going home at all. He's going to Virginia for Christmas with his family. But I really don't know what to get him. I really want to get him like a nice long coat, but is he gonna be like, I don't really care. But also like guys always like to get clothing because they don't like to buy it for themselves in my opinion. But also he is obsessed with sushi and Japanese food in general. And I kind of want to get him um, sushi making classes or like a one-off class and I'd go with him. Cause he was talking about it the other night when we were at this Japanese restaurant. So that could be a fun thing, but I feel like I need to get him something else. That's the update. I'm not succeeding, waiting for my dad to reply. Oh, he goes, maybe jeans. All right, dad. <laughs> Thanks. Um, maybe I'll get him something experiential as well. But yeah, if you guys have any ideas for me to get Ryan, and like there's so many gift guides I know, and I've watched a lot of my friends' videos and stuff like that, but Ryan's just a unique breed. I usually get him something to do with beer, or like I want to get him like football tickets, or like something. I, I love giving experiences. I just think that's so cool, but then also then they have nothing to like open when they, and he does not care, I don't know. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm also, <sighs> So I am only vlogging December 1st through 15th. I am so sorry. Well, Vlogmas. I'll be vlogging every day after that, but into um, weekend of my life and week in my life. But next, today's Tuesday, a week from tomorrow, I'm supposed to be flying home to Tampa. I'm so excited. I love my family, but I was quite literally just home for Thanksgiving. And everyone that I've talked to in New York is actually staying until like way later. So now I'm like, should I stay through that weekend and leave on like the 19th or the 20th? My family's gonna be sad. But I just have nothing to do at home. I mean, I do, I have things to do. I should probably like get back on the Peloton at home and like just hang out with Finley and like relax. But like I'm loving it. New York and Christmas time is so cute. So I don't know. And when I bought my plane tickets to go home, I bought like that extra $30 insurance on Delta where you can switch your flight or whatever or cancel it, I don't even know. Um, and I bought the not and I bought the refundable version of my ticket It was like a little extra just because I had this feeling So I'm trying to decide what to do if you guys have any tips. Let me know Vibes are good this morning. We're gonna get started with the day in a little all right guys I just got ready for the day a brown outfit. We've got brown long sleeve shirt some neutral colored um, sweatpants these are from boundless loungewear shirts from Zara Jacket is from Aloe. I love this. I will link it below. It's so warm. It's a little bit chillier out today. Um, socks and Adidas sneakers. Tote bag with snacks and kombucha and my planner and lots of things because we are going to the hair salon. To the salon! <laughs> I'm going to see it, Madison. We are fixing my hair. I don't know what I'm going to come out looking like, but it's going to be a lot better. I don't know if we're doing short hair, if we're doing more extensions. I don't, like, I don't know what I'm doing to my roots. Like, We're just going to go have a time, so I'm really excited before, I can't wait for the after. <laughs> Tell them what you did. 
did really quick. Okay, so basically what we did with Danielle today is we did a drop root on her, so basically a reverse balayage. So we put no bleach in her hair other than around her hairline for her big money piece. And then um, we dropped the low lights in between while still keeping a little bit of blonde so it has a nice blend. Then we used our One Step One extension. One step grab left, one right here. The hair and shop. Basically, it is like the better version of a sew and weft because it's nice and natural and it grows out with the hair without putting a lot of weight in it. And we put about about a pack and a half in and cut it and styled it. And now she's perfect. I'm so happy. I just did like some darker for the winter and it just looks so natural. She did such a great job. So thank you. Here, pull it out back and we'll do a little spin. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh my so god. As you guys can see. More of a dropped root, still nice and blended. I'm obsessed. Gorgeous. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Guys, I am so obsessed. Of course, it's dark out now. So I'm like right in Midtown. I'm actually, this salon is off of Fifth Ave. So I'm gonna go to Bergdorf's because I've been wanting to go. I saw Sarah Bell, I always call her Sarah Bell, Sarah Elizabeth, whatever. She, I've known her for years. She went and got a Bergdorf's taxi cab ornament. And I've been looking for a taxi cab ornament for my tree as like a moving to New York City. Maybe I'll get one for my home in Florida too. So I'm gonna go there, it'll be a little festive. Why not? We're up in Midtown and then we'll head back. We've got some plans tonight. I don't know, maybe we'll just get a little Christmas shopping now. Let's go, it's cold out. Like, wow. Midtown definitely stays being very festive. So, oh, I'm still just so obsessed with my hair. I'm so happy with it. I did something similar to this last year too. It just, it's just so fun for winter and it looks so natural and get, I'm happy with it. So, shout out Madison. Um, I'm on the roof right now. I just wanted, I was ready a little early, I think because my hair was already done. So I just came back, put on some makeup. I'm headed to dinner with Mary, Steven, and Morgan. We're going to Spritz, New York. It's a restaurant. And they also carry the Spritz Society drink that my friends Claudia and her husband Ben um, created. So I'm really excited to try that out. And then after, we might try and sneak over to Rolf's um, German restaurant because it's like the Christmas bar and restaurant. And we might see if we can at least get a drink there because Mary, Steven wanted to eat there, but we couldn't get a hold of them. We didn't really know the reservation vibe, but we want to at least see it. And then I'm going to see if I can convince them to go ice skating. That's like a lot of things. Being very ambitious right now, but that's just how I do. So yeah, um, but I'm on the roof right now, guys. Just look at this view. Like, hello, New York. My outfit is nothing crazy. I took some shots in my apartment before I came up here that I'll overlay, but I'm wearing this crop fuzzy um, sweater. I really oh, i think it's from princess polly actually and then surprise i'm wearing my leather flare pants that i literally can't get enough of off of revolve and then my black zara booties and the same jacket because it's so warm like i haven't felt cold once today like i can tell it's cold out but i am like i've got a blanket on <laughs> so i'm about to call the uber i was gonna train but i trained back from fifth ave oh yeah and i went to fifth ave i bought an ornament at Bergdorf Goodman. They didn't have the taxi one, so I got a uh, apple that says New York City. So cute, and I think I'm gonna like get one from Bergdorf's every year for my apartment, so that's that. I'm in a really good mood, and I'm excited. We're gonna have a little festive evening, so let's get to it. We just filled this up with this huge cup. I know, what flavor is this? Pineapple. Pineapple, he said this is a good one, I'm excited. All right, just left Spritz. It was such an amazing experience. They literally spoiled us there. It was so much fun. We had the best food. Definitely see just going. They have a speakeasy right next door called Jewel Thief. It's so sick, like I'll be going back there. The vibes are good, they played lots of Drake, which we love. We are now walking to Rolf's German restaurant. We're gonna see if they'll take us in. I want like a spiked hot cocoa, if that's a thing. 
Is that what a hottie toddy is? Or is that spiced? It's like bourbon. Bourbon and tea and mozzarella. Ooh, no, that sounds nice too. Um, I just need to bring attention to Morgan right now. <laughs> She's a little <laughs> cold. <laughs> it's cold. We're walking 20 minutes. We're really proud of ourselves because the Ubers were just god awful expensive. now I had such a lovely evening spritz was so fun obviously and then Rolf's was honestly so worth the hype it was gorgeous you walk in Christmas music is blasting it's like a I thought it was just a restaurant but there was like a full bar like we just stood there and hung out highly suggest going if you can while you're in the city it's so festive they had all these great holiday drinks it was just a really good time and got to spend some quality time with my friends that was really nice by the time all that happened, I should have figured we did not have time to go ice skating, but I will go ice skating before I go home. Um, but I didn't get to this when I got back, so I wanna show you guys now. My ornament I got from Bergdorf's. I'm so excited. Um, they wrapped it so beautifully, and I don't, oh, there's my mother mask, okay. And I don't wanna unwrap it, but this is a gift for myself, so we will do this together. Unboxings. Here's the ornament I got. I thought it was fitting for my first apartment in New York City. The big apple. It's so cute. I love it. It's like an ombre apple, New York City. They had so many cute ones. It was hard. They had like one of Anna Winter. Like they had some really good ones, some cute ideas. Um, but I just wanted something New York themed. Okay, I'm gonna cut this tag off later, but for the purpose of the vlog, we will hang this ornament up together. Yay! <laughs> that was a terrible job at hanging up an ornament, but she's there. That's a wrap for Vlogmas day seven. I'm so excited to do it all over again tomorrow. I'm still loving my hair. Thank you all for all the love. I'm gonna go to bed. Tomorrow's a really fun day. I'm hosting Secret Santa at my apartment tomorrow night. Anyways, I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for following along on today's video and subscribe and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.